National Museum Day. Coordinated each year with the International Council of Museums, International Museum Day is an international day held annually on or around May 18th. The event highlights a specific theme which changes every year to reflect the basis of the International Museum community's preoccupations. International Museum Day provides the opportunity for museum professionals to meet the public and alert them as to the challenges that museums face. A museum is a nonprofit, permanent institution in the service of society and its development open to the public, which acquires, conserves, researches, communicates, and exhibits the tangible and intangible heritage of humanity and its environment for the purposes of education, study, and enjoyment. International Museum Day therefore serves as a platform to raise public awareness on the role museums play in the development of society today on an international level. Since its creation in 1977, International Museum Day has gained increasing attention. In 2009, International Museum Day attracted the participation of more than 20,000 museums hosting events in more than 90 countries. This year's theme, The Future of Museums, Recover and Reimagine. International Museum Day 2021 invites museums, their professionals, and communities to create, imagine, and share new practices of co-creation of value, new business models for cultural institutions, and innovative solutions for the social, economic, and environmental challenges of the present. Thousands of museums around the world participate in this day. Events through the years have included visits and workshops for schools, special performances of plays, music, and traditional dances, seminars with international speakers, and even photo contests. Some museums even hold events for the entire week. Did you know? The beard of Tutankhamun's golden mask fell off during the cleaning process in the Egyptian Museum in 2014. The workers used epoxy glue to reattach the beard, but since that was not the professional method and permanent damage was done to the mask, they were prosecuted for this in 2016. There are more museums in the United States than there are Starbucks and McDonald's put together. In 2016, a 91-year-old woman filled out a crossword that turned out to be a $120,000 piece of artwork in a German museum. There's a museum in Croatia named Froggyland, which is entirely composed of over 500 stuffed frogs put into human positions. Oh no! The largest art heist in history was completed in 1990 at the Isabella Stewart Gardner Museum in Boston, totaling 13 paintings worth over $500 million. To this day, all of the empty frames are still hanging, acting as placeholders until the pieces are returned. Museums are an important part of the human learning experience. Please take some time to look at this video's description where you'll find a small list of museums that are offering virtual tours. From London to Seoul, you can experience the best museums around the world without ever leaving your seat. Happy International Museum Day, everyone! Thank you for listening today. My name is Kevin. Welcome to my channel, Everything Kevin. If you like this video, please press like below. If you'd like to see more, please press subscribe. Take it easy, man.